Welcome, ladies and gentlemen, to Let's Play Train Mechanic Simulator 2017. Oh, you thought because of all this epic music we're gonna play an action game? No! No, we're going to repair magnificent engines and transportation modes. Uh, let's go ahead and start a new game. This game is gonna release March 23rd, if I'm not completely wrong. I am doing so well on Car Mechanic Simulator that, you know, going to trains is just the next thing. And I hope there's gonna be, like, an, you know, airplane repair simulator soon. What is it with this music? We just had this really epic battle music. And now we're going here all... I mean, fine. This sounds like like I'm working at a diner, if anything. Welcome to the game Train Mechanic 2017. Your train mechanic and your task will to be repair rail vehicles. Oh, I wanted to repair trains in three different workshops. Under your care will be both archaic and simple steam engines, as well as very modern electric locomotives. Each locomotive will be assigned to a garage adapted to repair its respective type. Good luck. We're gonna need it. All right, perfect. Here we are. Um. I'm, I'm, I'm fairly certain we shouldn't be repairing anything here. Much less a train, but hey, hey, okay, it's whatever. Where, where are we and why am I shaking around like this? I, I like, I like the head movement. Anyways, electrical workbench. Really? This is, it's a piece of wood. I guess it's an electric workbench because it has a symbol of a battery over it. That's, that, that, that should do it. That's good enough. Mechanics workshop. That it has it has the mechanic cogs over there, and that's a hydraulics workbench. Fantastic. We got a shelf with things on there. Lot lots of shelves. I'm I'm so glad this is a thing. So where's the train? Ooh. Oh no! Oh no! I gotta gotta go back. Man, I I know so little about cars. I'm pretty sure trains are easier. Pretty sure they're easier. With me is my beautiful Twitch chat, in case you can't tell. There's a crowbar and a knife. I'm not sure what I'm gonna need this for, but if that guy doesn't stub head bobbing, I'm gonna I'm I'm just gonna jump in front of a train. Work order, look at that snazzy chair. Alright, work order. Acceptance of work orders. Welcome to the work order acceptance system. Yes, here you will be able to accept work orders. Oh, really? In the work order acceptance systems, I'll be able to accept work orders. Missions assigned to a given workshop. In this window, you can switch between work orders to skip a given task and possibly finish it later. All right, job order number one. Welcome to the game train mechanics sim. Your first mission will be a simple train repair so you can become familiar with the basics of the game. Your task will be repairing a locomotive in which the steel and rubber springs in the front truck have been damaged. What? Sure, $250? How is this a thing? Like, I get way more in car mechanics, Sim. I, I feel you should be paid better for a train, but that that's just me. Just me. It appears that the cause of the locomotive's malfunction is a damaged carriage. Probably they're- they- what is it with the head bobbing? It's really silly. Probably they are steel and rubber springs. Locate the exact cause of the defect and replace a new part. Alright, I'm gonna get $125. Uh, bonus for low cost, $500, and for complete achievement, $125. Uh, estimated cost of the order. Huh, okay, that's actually a little bit more. All right, show the account. Okay, cool. This is fine, I guess. Let's close this. Oh, we've escaped, my bad. So, we got a train. Fantastic. This is a pretty big thing. There's an engine. Okay, I... I can see that. That is the motor truck. And uh, this is the fuel tank. And that's another motor truck. Okay, job order. Still haven't found parts. How about we have a look at the motor truck? In this mode, you can strip down locomotives taking apart all their available components. Often to be able to get to a part, you will need to remove other parts, even the operating those operating properly. Please remember about this. Please remember about this. Alright, cool. Let's um I have no idea how it would reach this otherwise, but yeah, this, look, the steel and rubber springs, they, they look bad. Alright, so we have the, this assembly mode, testing mode, okay, testing mode. In this mode, you can check the condition of various train elements to estimate the profitability of the repair, Pro profit, profitability. Huh. Remember the higher level of wear of individual elements, the greater the risk of unsuccessful repair of the element. Alright, let's, uh, it's very reminiscent of Car Mechanic Simulator, which it is, I don't think it's anywhere related to that. Okay, I guess those two are pretty done. So how about we take those out? Oh, okay, so 
there are these two things. Sure. There's no hole to hold them in place, but that's okay. So far, so good. It's, music is a little, uh, little, little annoying, honestly. How, how about how about we go a little bit easier on that music? Where is it coming from anyway? I don't know. I don't know. Is it is it this 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 little shitty radio there? Maybe. Who knows? Anyway, so this motor truck needs uh, installation mode. Wait, I need to repair a thing. So, do we buy new things? Just parts warehouse. All right. So this is the electrical workbench. Mechanics workbench. Sub -spe specific sub assemblies may be repaired on the workbenches. We have divided into three categories mechanics, hydraulics, and electrical. The cost of the repair will be added to the account. The difficulty is that there is no certainty as to the success of the repair. If the repair is successful, the part will be repaired in a percentage of 90 to 100%. If, however, we don't manage to regenerate the part, it will be even more damaged and sad. The price of repair is significantly lower than the purchase of new parts. The more improved the workbench, the greater the chance. All right. Well, let's repair. Uh, cost 3,000 to repair. Chance of success 100%. We are uncertain if we can repair this, but it's 100%. Sure, I'll repair them. Success, the part is fully functional. Excellent. Um, so we're just gonna bring it back onto the motor truck. Um. I, I, I kind of like more of the EDM music. I'm kind of missing that already. Uh, installation mode. Cool. Yeah, there are the parts missing. Steel and rubber. In this window, you can manage your spare parts. You can sell them. The profits of their resale will decrease the amount to the account. The better a part condition, the more profit you generate from it. Sell. Sweet. Wait, 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 wait. Wait, 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 wait. And over there, this thing. And I think we're done. This is easy peasy lemon squeezy. I don't know why the other parts, again, aren't broken. I mean, they don't look like in the best shape, but whatever. Are we good? I mean, you already have a tablet. The tablet is your information center. Here you can start online stores with parts. There are free shops for mechanics, hydraulics, and electrical systems. Improve your garage and go to the mechanics help center that describes all of the operations. Well, I don't need anything right now. Improve the workshop. Ooh, look, you can buy all these things like a screw gun and you can use cash monies to upgrade that. Perfect. Okay, I think we're good. So the job order, we're gonna open that up with M and we fixed it. Bonus for low cost. Nice, we got a bonus. Income 750. What? We're only getting 750 even though, okay, fine. Income, 125, 125 and 500. Yeah, that's all. Ah oh well, 750. There's, there's so many trains to repair, I'll, I'll have so much to do. Now the work order, job order number two, the driver complains about faulty brake system, locate the cause of the defect and make repairs. This work order is slightly more difficult, remember that each part is repaired on a different workbench. If you're not able to repair the part yourself, you can buy a new part using the tablet. So modern, so modern. I wish someone would clean up this place. This looks bad. <sighs> it's journey, they're waiting for the midnight train going anywhere. <laughs> anywhere. Uh, okay, three parts not found. Maybe we can make like $200. No wonder this place is so run down. We're, we're charging so little. What, what a nice picture of nothing. Okay. Eagle Petrol. I wonder if anyone sponsored those. Okay, that's a train. I don't know. I, I know jack shit about trains. Um, in the braking system, I want to say that, yeah, in the front here, there's the brake caliper. I've heard that term before. Okay, there's the, the disassemble. Okay, look at that. Get that stuff out of here. Get it out of my sight. What's that? The brake caliper arms. We're gonna have to take the brake. Wait, what? Okay, this has to go. And then this piston has to go, which obviously is also in a pretty rough shape. Wait, wait, wait. Very well. I have a hard time believing that it's so easy to, to maintain a train. I just... I mean, already with cars, it, it seemed very easy, but a train? That seems like a, like, a, like a lot of work. And it's definitely, it seems to be cheaper than to repair my car. I mean, $500 to repair springs on a train. That's, 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 that's a steal. Um, all right, job order. Let's have a look. I think, yeah, we found all things. 
We're gonna go back and we're gonna go to our workbench. Perfect. 12%. Repair, 31%. Ooh, it's not a whole lot of chance here. 100%. Yeah, I'll obviously use that. The part is fully functional. Hydraulic brake piston. I Oh, wrong workbench. I got a feeling that, you know, you shouldn't be repairing train parts yourself. You should probably buy fresh ones. I'll try. 31%. And failed. The part is even more damaged. Well, screw you then. Screw you then. Um, so parts warehouse. Oops. With I. Uh, sell. Sure. Who buys broken stuff like that? Uh, I'm gonna have to find out where I'm gonna get that brake caliper. Um. Yeah, brake caliper. Uh, parts warehouse is that's what the stuff that I have. Ah, <sighs> brake caliper. Uh. Engine parts? Mechani me mechanical parts. Shit. I, I misclicked. Mechanical parts. Caliper. Bra there it is. Oops. I took a screenshot. Okay. Brake caliper. Bought. Oh, you can click them and then buy, buy them together. That is so nice. I think I need to buy a piston. I hope so. Uh, sure. Sure. I, I hope so. If not, this is going to be really awkward, really fast. Uh, M for the job. Brake caliper arm and brake caliper and the hydraulic brake piston. Whoops. No, I, I think I got it. Okay, I got it. All right, assembly. Oh, why are you stuttering? Okay, uh, assembly mode, testing mode, uh, installation mode. There you go. Uh, that goes there. I don't know what it does. It, it does a thing. That's all you need to know. There goes the brake caliper. All right, squeeze you on. Let's put the brake piston on. Good. Like, how can the repair cost, like, how can you get $125 when a part costs, like, $4,000? That's crazy. I mean, it's just insane. No wonder we live in this shack. Well, and we're done. Job order. Finish order. Well, we didn't get a bonus for finishing with low cost because that's relevant. <sighs> Wait, this isn't a car. It isn't. And that's good. That's, that's fine. I made $500 on this. Next train. Am I like the only guy that repairs trains? Sometimes the task will involve finding and repairing locomotives that were damaged somewhere on the routes of the game world and then towing them off to the appropriate workshops and making repairs. For this purpose, you use a special repair train. This time, a diesel locomotive broke down in Square D1, located and towed to the workshop. Ooh, I get to actually pick one up? That's exciting! Alright, in progress. How, how does that work? Oops, shit. No, I fell down. Do I have to go out and, you know, pull it myself? I honestly have no idea what to do. It says you have to get it yourself. God, something's squeaking here. And once I want to oil it. I, I hear squeaking and it drives me crazy. All right. I, I don't know what it is, but somebody's gonna oil it. Exit. Leave the garage. Do I do I need to leave the garage? Does that end the game? I don't know. What do I need to do? What do I need to do? <sighs> Fine. I'll, I'll, yeah. Okay. Leave the garage. Am I getting the train? Am I leaving the game? I don't know. Find the locomotive in Square D1 and tow it to the workshop. I will try my best. All right, there I am. Uh, I didn't expect that I get to drive around. Increase engine power. I got this. Ramp it up. What? Um, Man, I'm fast. Okay, use the horn. Sweet! West port, uh, east tunnel, east tunnel, west tunnel. All right, wait, decrease and break. All right, all right, all right, all right, wait. Shit, where's, where's D1? I, I, okay, map. Yeah, this is, uh, okay, I gotta make my way up there somehow. It's, it's quite, quite a while away, isn't it? So, okay, that I did, I definitely did that wrong. Not entirely sure how I navigate here, but I think I just uh, uh, go uh, switch the direction around. Yeah, I can just I can just drive around. Fuck it, it's fine. I don't need to tell anyone where I'm going. All right, we're going. Uh, actually, let's go left, and then let's head straight up. Oh shit! Oh no, I can't. I can't. Holy shit! 
All right. This this might work. Ah, just go full speed. It'll be fine. Hi. Hi. All right. What's that? What a weird town. What what a very odd town. It's called West Asia Valley. Okay. I will believe you. What an odd train system. It's in D1, remember. Okay, it wants me to go straight ahead now. And then left and then right. I, I don't I don't know what, what those things are. Alright, that's a train station. Beautiful. Um feels surreal the world. <laughs> Interruption! Shit, uh so maybe this way? Yeah, this is fine. This this looks very safe. Don't worry about a thing. I honestly did not expect my, me to uh, uh, go on a train hunt. All right, we're gonna go right here. Or, or, or you, wait, is that is that what you want? I don't know what the things are to the right. I think they're just here to confuse me. All right, we're at A. A. That's that's super not D. But we're going north, so I just have to go. I guess uh, east, northeast from here. Oh, it's a different biome. It's snowing or raining. Oh, wow. Well, those are those are things that I did clearly did not expect. Yeah, just just keep going. Yo! Oh, there there it is. Haha. -ha. Shit. I missed I missed I missed my uh uh exit. Yeah, this looks fine. I just go that fast around the curves. That's Oh shit. Why can't I I can't ah! Can't, can't, can't control this. Maybe that wasn't D1. Find the locomotive in square D1 and tow it to the workshop. Oh, that also means I gotta find it. Gotta come from the right direction. And it's another biome. I think it's showing me it back there. We're in D1 now. Perfect. Please don't tell me that I have to find my way back because I did not pay attention. What is this? Like an old western town. Found it. Oh, perfect. Thank you. We're actually we actually have to drive back. Okay. Good good enough. Tow the train to the diesel train depot. Uh Interruption. <laughs> yeah, just just keep going. Yep, the the horn is very loud, I agree. But then again, it's a train horn, so that's that's understandable. Is is it back there? Is that where we have to go because I have a hard time believing that is where I came from. So I will not go there. Map. Um Oh, I can just look on this map and see where we're going. I don't need to look what's coming ahead. Screw that. I'm pretty sure it's in the bottom left somewhere. That's where where that is. I hope so. Self engine depot. I think we're gonna have to turn right here. Village on the lake. South pass. East side station. It doesn't tell me where it is on that map to the train depot. Because there's only one. Diesel engine depot. West mountain station. Come on. Diesel engine depot. Ooh. Damn it. Okay, I'm gonna have to do a big run around. Well, so be it. We got this. And I'm only gonna get like $200 for the whole goddamn thing. Hopefully not. Alright. Yay! Go full speed! Derailment is not an option. Not in this world. What an odd little world this is. I'm glad there's all these stations for nobody. Beautiful forest. Can I like go? Oh, camera! I can change the camera. Oh, that's so much better. Oh yeah! Look at all these screens. Perfect. Look at all the stuff here. It doesn't really, you know, I don't know. Okay, so we're driving for a station. Hi. All right, good. The diesel weasel. 
I don't think we can build our own train and, you know, uh, pimp it up. Go to the auction house, buy a train, and make it super snazzy. I don't, I don't think that's going to be an option in this game. All right, diesel engine depot. Is it? Is it this? Where we? I think we need to go backwards. So, I'm gonna have to slow down. All right, and then we go backwards. Uh, camera. So can I switch? Oh, okay, I can switch direction. Perfect. Yeah, just full speed ahead, right in there. Can I see myself in there? Nope, I'm a ghost driver. Ghost train. It's a great new movie on Netflix, Ghost Train. Fishy Burn, thank you so much for subscribing. Interruption! Damaged vehicle has been restored properly and towed into workshop. How it, well, how it has been restored? I haven't repaired it yet. I think they meant recovered. That, that, would, that would be a thing. Uh, okay, find a locomotive did. Just as we expected, the problem proved to be damaged transmission in the truck. Remove and replace them. Them transmissions. Sure. A oh, whole $250. Oh, please. Please. Estimated cost of the order $87,400. i am glad that they, like, have less than a percentage point for the guy that repairs the whole goddamn thing. You gotta be kidding me. I'm I'm not willing to work for this little in-game money. Like I I'm serious. I feel I feel cheated. Job order number three, right? That's in progress. Like five hundred dollars. What am I supposed? I just brought a train in here. Like that's cheaper than getting a car towed. Uh, parts. Right, 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 right. Uh, I'm gonna have to find them. Right. Not found. Huh. Transmission. Is that is that is it, is that the drive gear? Is that it? Testing mode. Looks pretty ruined. Luckily, it's totally rusted. Yeah, it's, uh, rusted, rusted. I like that. Disassembly mode. How do I get you out? Um. By taking the electric motor rotor shift tip chip chip tip tip shaft. All right, that wasn't that wasn't too bad. Click, click. Just a tip. Okay, I don't think we can repair the drive gears, but I can always try. Because why the fuck not? Drive gear, 5% chance. No. No. The thing is also, I'm not getting the, the difference from making those parts. No, I'm getting like $250 as a bonus. You know what? You can suck it and pay the $40,000 extra for me not repairing it. Because you're not willing to give me a little bit more. So, yeah. Anyway, uh, it's mechanical, I assume. Uh, was it gear? Filter? Drive gear. Uh, two carts. Two of them. Yep, looks good. Order. Mm-hmm. Sure, 92,000. That's good enough. That's good enough. Uh, installation. How can I even afford these things? Wait, value 100. I can sell a $40,000 drive gear back for $100. What, 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 what? There's probably more material value if I melt this down. Un, 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 unbelievable. Unbelievable. I, w I think I wouldn't... I didn't expect myself when I woke up this morning to be ranting about how expensive parts is. Uh, it looks like everything's already repaired. You can finish the task from the work order sheet. Mm-hmm. Yes, I can. Finish order. Well, at least I made, like, what? 250? Low cost. Oh, sweet. Yeah, it's like selling back textbooks. You are correct. That's, uh, it actually hurts really bad to think about that. How expensive textbooks are now. It's, uh, also, I didn't keep the old parts. That's cool. I gave them back. I guess. Job order number four. Well, the main railway station informs us that a locomotive pulling passenger cars has not arrived on time. Check what happened. They have no idea. No way to find the train. I have to go there. Maybe zombies have overrun the train. Anyways, we're going to find that out in the next episode. Thank you guys so much for watching. Thank you so much for hanging out in the chat and indulging me while I try to repair trains. In any case, thanks so much for watching. I'm Weasel. I'm out and I hope to see you around. Bye-bye. Bound, <laughs> <laughs>
Ciao, ciao, ciao.